draw here against Corwin, but uh, something tells me it could have been all three points in the end there. It could, yeah. We, we started slow. We've, we've gone 2-0 two, two down in the first 10 minutes, which was really poor for ourselves. That's not something we, we want to have a start of the game. It's almost like them having a 2-0 head start. But after that, I mean, they've had one chance for the rest of the game and we, we've been brilliant. We've created chances, we've had shots. A lot, to be fair, have gone over and gone wide. But when we start hitting the target, it's, it's, been, it's been a positive for us. We've created so many chances today and obviously got to come back to get, to get a point. Yeah, in recent weeks, we've seen ourselves going uh, a goal down quite early on. It was good character from the side, wasn't it, to pull it back to 2 all? Yeah, yeah, brilliant. As Like I said, after that first 10, 15 minutes, we were much a better team. You know, we dominated large spells of the game. We've created so many chances today. We, we, we should have won it. Probably could We could have won it, probably should have won it. But in the end, we've, we've done enough to get a point. We've got dragged ourselves back into the game. And yeah, we've got ourselves a, we've got ourselves a well-earned point, I think. A couple of changes um, from yourself at half-time. I don't know what you said to the girls, but to pull a goal back immediately two minutes into the second half, I guess the exact sort of reaction you wanted. Yeah, it was a similar similar start to, to ourselves. We, we started slow, they started slow, but yeah, the, the reaction, the, the positivity going forward as soon as we as soon as soon we kicked off was brilliant. I think we knew the, the next goal in this game was massive and, and we managed to get that. Then, you know, 10, 15 minutes later, we kicked on, we got another one and then maybe we should have won it, but, but we've done enough, like I said, again, to, to win ourselves a point. You mentioned that they had, what, one chance in the second half and you call on your goalkeeper who pulls off a tremendous save. Yeah, it was a brilliant save, to be fair to Kat. She's not she's not had a lot to do in the game in terms of uh, being battered with shots. She's had a few here and there and then around her. She's made a few decent saves down down like down close to her. But yeah, that was a brilliant save. It, it's kept us in the game. Unfortunately, it would have been would have been unfortunate that would have probably won them the game if they scored. It was that late on, but it was a brilliant save. And that's, that's what keepers are there for, aren't they? To make those massive saves. Yeah, it's a point against a side who I guess will be up there at the end of the season in Corwin, a good side, established team, aren't they as well? So again, it's as a new side, we're testing ourselves constantly against these uh, more established teams. Yeah, yeah, they're one of the one of the sort of three, four decent teams in this league that, that can cause us problems in terms of how they play. Um, that's again, we didn't deal with that in the first 10 minutes and that's why they they have caused us two problems in scoring two goals. But in terms of us, I think we are a better team, but it's just getting that result on the pitch in the end of the day. Yeah, just disappointing, I guess, that we couldn't get the win, especially now with, what, a two-week break um, from league action, and then we're back finally, I guess, at home. Yeah, yeah, we are. We, it's our second. It's our, we've done now. We've got one away game left for the rest of the season, which is a positive. So it's getting them home games in now. It'll be great to, to be back at Penakai in two weeks' time. And we, we've got Penrith Bay the first week and then Mountain Rangers the next week. So hopefully it'll be, a, it'll be a happy return for the end of November. Yeah, that's a really good positive for us in terms of where we want to be at the end of the season. We've got home advantage quite a lot. It's so difficult for you guys almost every week, travelling away to uh, you know, all these different places like Bethesda and then Canberra and places like that. When you've got that home advantage, that can really pay for you, can't it? Yeah, yeah. So like we said, Bethesda, they've they played a few home games and it would be nice to get them at their our pitch, see what they're like at our pitch. But yeah... It, it does make a massive difference because obviously it's a pitch we're playing on every week which will you know, be comfortable for us so we've got, to get us, we've got them two games in a row to get ourselves used to it and then we can kick on into December, January then and playing our home games and hopefully winning them all. Cheers Luke.